At the start of your test, when you struck out from that tiny island, you saw me there dressed in a robe. Immediately you knew something was wrong. So without even knowing it, you dove into Sora's dream. And you became exactly what that sigil on your back represents. A dream eater to protect Sora from nightmares. Me? I'm a dream eater? Correct. But you failed to protect him. After all your efforts to command the darkness and protect those you cherish, it is a shame you locked that power away in the end. Except... it's not over. I can still save Sora. So you understand what to do. Set the darkness in you free, and you can rescue your friend. Ansem. Or... Xehanort. You used to be a Keyblade wielder. But darkness stole your heart. And the Keyblade with it. Don't you see? That's half the reason I'm even on this journey. After allowing darkness into my heart, am I still fit to wield the Keyblade? Even after locking you away, here you are, haunting me again. So I get it now. There's no point in trying to hold the darkness back. At last, you see clearly. You know, when I look at you, there's this memory that flashes back. A secret I said I'd keep when I was little. The main reason I kept dreaming about seeing the outside world was because of him. Mm -hmm. My journey begins here. And now, I'm going back to the real world. And then to Sora's side. That... is your answer? Yes. I know the way. Consume the darkness. Return it to light. You can try. Something special. Something special. Here you go. 
around in Ansem, you're part of my heart now. Part of the light. Ever the fool boy. And forever, a pawn of the darkness. Strength to protect what matters. Oh. This place. Did I finally make it out of the dream? Sora and I have been split up since the start of our journey. Because Ansem... No. Because Xehanort planned it. And that means... We're a long way off course from the Mark of Mastery exam Yen Sid gave us. Alright. Sora's gotta be here. 
somewhere. <laughs>